Hey, it's your boy Crypto Expat back with another video. We're going to cover a bunch of projects, just some updates and what's happening. And uh, I'll talk about a new project. Uh, well, it's it's not really that new, but it's it's new enough. It's just a, heaps of things to talk about. There's so much happening, right? So let's uh, get into the video. And let's waste no more time. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're a new visitor, welcome. If you're a returning visitor, welcome back. I really appreciate your support. Hit that subscribe button if you enjoy the content. Okay, so Spaceport, oh faithful. Uh, yeah, look, I just, I just love this game. I just, I just love playing it. And guys, I got some sad news with Spaceport. Well, it just depends. You know how you kind of see it. Uh, they're actually getting rid of this game, and they're going to have a new game. So I don't know what the new game's going to be, but I did go on the Telegram and I said that, um, you know, guys keep the same game, but just upgrade it. And I think they're all over it. Like they already know what's going on, obviously, right? Uh, what I suggested to them was keep the same game, but had have NFTs where you can add, you know, things to the spaceship. So you buy things like extra power, extra speed, extra rockets, extra missiles, lasers, uh, and they're NFTs that you actually buy, which make you obviously your ship stronger. And, uh, you know, you can earn more, you know, you can, you know, basically just keep the same game, but just make it better. But I think they have a pretty good clue what's going on. So hopefully, uh, this is going to improve spaceport. I mean, people supporting spaceport is still like, it's just, it's, it's still crazy. Like it's gone up. A lot. I mean, I've still got a, I've still got a thousand bucks in here, and it's still doing really well. Like it's just hit an all time high, and it just seems like they've got a very good group of supporters. Like their their people that support this game is just unbelievable. They're fanatics. I can see why because it's a it's a cool game to play. So they have changed some things in the game though. When you come in, it's a twenty percent tax, and it's only a five percent uh, you can earn on your game. So essentially, you've got to play the game for four days before you uh, you get back the tax that you paid to get in the game. Okay, so that's that can be a good thing or a bad thing, depends on how you look at it. But um, it is what it is, and the game is evolving uh, to the next level. So we'll see when that happens. I'm not sure of the dates, uh, but just go in their Discord, and you can find out about all the information or, or their Telegram as well. Okay, so let's move on. This one here, Block uh, Creatures, that has dumped quite a lot. I'm not sure why. I don't know. Someone's dumping. Maybe the devs. Or I don't know. But anyway, um, it was looking really good at one point. Uh, $15, $20. And then um, now it's sort of dumped. It dumped lower. But now it's come back to $8. So I don't know what happened here. See, see where it dumped right here? It dumped $8. Now it's at $8.70, so it's not too bad. It's come back a little bit, but um, this is a long-term game. This game shouldn't be dumping, so I don't know. I've still got uh, my creatures in here, and, and now that I've been playing this game for, it seems, two weeks, I think, or less than two weeks, um, now my Moolah rate is increasing. So if I win on this one, I'm going to win 0 0.63, and all these are increasing. So your your my rate of earning has gone up. So I don't know this one. I did like this quite a lot because it was slow, but the pro token price has you know dumped a bit. But I don't know. You just got to sometimes you got to give these things time. Um, I liked it when it was up to uh, twenty dollars, obviously, but it's gone down a lot. Second lane supply is fifty nine thousand and seventy nine seventy seven thousand burnt. Okay, five. It's only got a small market cap. It's only got five hundred nineteen thousand market cap. So, you know, it is, it is pretty pretty small game. Okay, let's let's moving on. Uh, plan to earn. They've just put a fifty percent withdrawal tax, and they've added this secret forest and this live str uh, live stream. You can add potions and stuff. Yeah, I don't know what these other ones are, but uh, look, I'm just I, mean, I don't really care about the other stuff. I'm just like you know what just. Let me just <laughs> make some money and pull out my uh, seed because I, I haven't broken even on this one yet. 
But this hasn't been my best one. Some people love this game. They've done well with it. I've, I haven't done well at all with it. I don't know why. I just keep losing at it. But it is what it is. I'm glad it was it was down for like a couple of days actually, and it's come back. So I don't really care. I mean, as long as I can fight and I can earn P2E and I can pull it out and swap for BNB. Wow, I won. That's the first time in a while. Uh, so yeah, it's got this early withdrawal tax. I, I don't even know when I can pull this out. Um, so I have to do some more research on that, but yeah, they're not going to let you take it out. Uh, well, you can take it out, but it's 50%. So I've, I've got the one more, one more turn here because every turn's three. So let's just go for normal because, you know, I'm trying to win the max amount of possible. You know, it is what it is. So let's just see if I can win this and then we'll move on to the next game. Look, at least it's up, at least it's earning. Can't say that for Pokemon Monster. I lost that one. Can't say that for Pokemon Monster. Uh, I don't know what's happened to that game. It's just gone. It's not profitable. Uh, maybe I have to relook at it because I haven't looked at it for a couple of days. Haven't even opened up the browser for a couple of days. Um, so yeah, so D ball. This is <laughs> I love D ball. You know, I'm, this is the one that I made the most money in. You know, um, at one point I was making nine hundred bucks a day with this. Obviously, we're not making that now. Because uh, the rewards aren't there anymore. Is this going the same way as Crypto Blades? It's still profitable. I mean, you're getting much, much less. Now they've got this reward. Um, and if you withdraw the reward, it's going to be... It's basically 3% per day. 45% tax. 3% per day. Every day that goes by, it's 3% off. So it's going to take you 15 days to take your rewards out. If you don't want to get taxed so the way the reason why they've done that is just to slow the game down uh, slow the payouts they've changed the ui so it looks different i don't know i like the old one better i mean this looks cooler but it just sometimes it doesn't load properly i just want it to be loaded properly so um i've still got 2.666 b-ball sitting there i've got two accounts so look i'm not getting much on these i'm making basically I'm doing all 50% fights. You know, that some people are doing 90%, 70% fights. I'm doing all 50% fights um, because I can just win more. And the ratio has dropped as well. There's there's more losses now. So each to their own. Everyone just has their own little system. I just have my own system. It's 50%. And I'm making roughly about one D-ball per uh, character. So I've got four characters. So I can make about... Four D ball per per uh, account, so um, I've got two accounts, so I can make about eight D ball a day um, from the two accounts. So you know, look, it's better than nothing. This was down for several days, and it wasn't look like it was coming back, but now that they've um, you know fixed up a few things, it's slower. But look, it's still free money for me because I broke even on this like on the third day. And I got into this over two weeks ago. So it's it's all free money, all right? So for people in D-Ball, at least you're earning. You're not earning much. you got to pay gas, but it is what it is, guys, okay? Alina X, this is one that I haven't got into this one, okay? So I'm just showing you guys. This came out uh, about a week ago. I didn't get in. Um, there were some people in our Patreon group that did get in. And one guy is making about $100 a day. The characters to get in on this are about less than 200, I think. I think it's about less than 200. Or I'll have to have a look. But you, yeah, basically, um, he said he's going to break even on about the fifth day. So, um, and he has four characters. So, uh, fifth fifth day, I think. I think it was. So, I don't know. It, look, you obviously got to play this game to know the numbers. And if you, if you're playing this game, um, you can tell us whether um you know how your numbers stack up if you're you know reaching roi sooner or later um, obviously it depends on what characters you get you know if you get better characters you can roi faster i heard i saw a video on this one says that uh you can um get the archer is the better one so um check that video out i'll put a link to to to, to below so again, I'm not in this. I'll probably give this one a miss because it's only a week, it's already a week old, and um, I, I like to get in these within the, the first three days. If if they don't, they um, 
they, you're sort of getting on the back end of it because these are pay to earn, okay? So they're not going to last long. If they pay fast, they're not going to last, okay? Fast is not last. So if you want something that's a little long term that pays slower, go play Splinterlands or Plant Undead or Axie Infinity. These games, these are not going to last, all right? So I'm just telling you now up front for those people that are new to this and are somewhat delusional or people that are delusional that think that they're going to get these type of rewards forever. This does not happen that way. Probably pass on this one, but if you're already in this one, then you're probably um, already making money with it. So you probably reach your ROI soon, maybe to five days. Comment below if you're uh, already in this one. So Crypto Zoom, they did a, they've got a new interface here, which does look a lot better, looks a lot nicer. But I mean, I don't really care about the interface. I just care about, like, are you going to make money with this thing or not? I had about two over 2,000 rewards uh, just pending, and I tried to withdraw it, and it only gave me basically a quarter of it. So I still have three quarters of that. And I keep on fighting and I'm not earning rewards. I don't know what the deal with that is. I think that they're just under maintenance or... So, I mean, if I'm not going to earn rewards, I'll show you now. I mean, I, I read somewhere that you're going to get paid for these rewards or not. I'm not exactly sure on it. But if you're just going to be playing and you're not getting rewards, you're just burning gas. All right? And there's no point in doing that. So I might just wait to see what the updates, see I lost that fight. But normally if it says if you win... Before, it will tell you that you won and how much Zoom you won. Well, now um, it just tells you that you won and it shows you the XP, but it doesn't give you the Zoom amount. So I might just have to wait um, on that one to see what the deal is. If you're playing this and if you actually get the rewards, but they're not just they're just not showing up, let us know in the comments. But Hopefully this one will come back and um, you can still start earning with this one because, like I, like I said, all these games, if, they, if they're fast, they won't last, okay? So this one lasts a lot longer than most, okay? Like I said, it's still earning, it's still making money, so I might as well just play it and make money. Um, you know, it is what it is. This is a new one that I saw. It's called Crypto Cards. Basically, it's an NFT racing game. Doc's team, they're from Vietnam. 100 million tokens. Yeah, 100 million tokens, just over 4,000 addresses. So it's still a new game. But basically what you do is you get these cars. You just, like, you mint this car, and then you can race it, and um, you can win uh, You win stuff by racing it, like upgrades and, and stuff like that. As you upgrade your car, you can, um, uh, you know, you just become faster and you can win more, more uh, races. And you get, like, five races a day, so... Yeah, basically it's a racing car game, okay? So you can play it. Uh, I think it's on desktop, and I think it's coming out. Yeah, it says coming soon on app. So that's going to be good for them because the app's going to be, um, it's going to bring a lot of people in. So even though this game is small now, you know, anything that goes on app, well, it's going to be big Like because people in third world countries can play it. When that happens, um, big things can happen. So... Um, yeah, I believe this is on um, BSC. So you just like you just come along here and you can buy the cars. So if you can unbox a car, it's four hundred C C C A R, which is the token, and that is roughly about forty one cents. So it's going to cost you about one hundred and sixty dollars for a car, and um. And then you just, like you says here, you have a 10% chance of getting a rare car. So it's just a blind box. You buy it and you hope for the best, pretty much. Okay, so you can stake it. All right, so you can stake it. APY is for 180%. It's not too shabby. It's not a lot, but it's still not, it's not too, it's okay. I believe the market, yeah, marketplace is not out yet. So this is a new game. Uh, it is very new. Uh, I just quickly read over the docs. Um, but that's basically the gist of it, what I just told you. Um, so that one's uh, Crypto Cars. Um, check that out if you're interested. If you like uh, car games, type of blockchain games, then um, this might be something that you might uh, look into or like playing. Okay, so with that said, that's pretty...
pretty much it. Um, look, we're doing, we're getting into NFTs as well. Um, there's still tons of projects coming out. There's tons of rugs also. There's been a few rugs that have come out. So just be careful, guys, all right? Um, that, you know, there's some rugs out there. And um, if you're not careful, you can get rugged. So this one here, this one rugged. Like I can't even show you the site. They've basically taken the site down. It's called Justice Arena. And they had a pre-sale of 800 BNB and it did a rug. And the website was like really, really cool. This was like, uh, what? What was that other one that rugged? Dodge Monsters or something? Did a rug? Probably even the same people. Yeah, and the website was looking really, really cool. Uh, they had a, a pre-sale on DX Sale. And they, it's pretty much a carbon copy of what happened to uh, Dodge Monsters. What they did was a 800 BNB went on uh, DX sale, and then once it finished, the DX sale automatically transfers that liquidity over to PancakeSwap. So as soon as it went on at PancakeSwap, the team dumped all their tokens so then they could just uh, soak up or take all of that liquidity that just transferred onto PancakeSwap. So they knew when exactly when it was happening, and then they just dumped all the tokens and just soaked it up, and were able to swap that, you know, useless token uh, into BNB and then cash out. And you can see here, this is just blatantly obvious of what happened here. And it just kept on dumping and dumping and dumping, and then the poor people, even in the pre-sale, couldn't even couldn't even cash out because the team was already dumping on them. So the pre-sale people were getting dumped on, let alone the public people. And this is exactly what happened um, with uh, Doge, Mon Dodge, Doge Monster as well. Exactly the same thing. You know, it wouldn't surprise me if it was the same team. So when you get into these pre-sales, you're taking a big risk um, getting in early because uh, the game, you know, you should wait till the game comes out until something proven. You know, they've got an MVP, um, minimal viable product. It's show that they're actually working on it because it takes a lot of manpower and uh, money to just to get a game up and running and um, that's how you stop from getting rugged so a lot of newbies are getting sucked suckered into this they think they're going to get into the next big thing and make all this money and have a lambo next week wrong guess what you're getting rugged so be smart out there there's a lot of scammers and you just need to be smarter okay so with that said um just a quick update um I'll give you an update on you know other stuff that we're doing, but if you want to get into this stuff um, when we're sort of doing it, uh, check out our Patreon group. The link will be below. Obviously, you know I haven't done a video for about three days because I've been so busy and um, uh, spending the time with um, the people in the in the group. Um, and you know when I get some time, I, I punch out a, a YouTube video, but. Um, it's uh, it's mainly focusing on the people in the Patreon group, so we can get in on these deals. You know, we got a, we got a, new, uh, a couple of good deals lately, even with IDOs. So, and we've got NFTs coming up. So it's very exciting. If you're interested in that sort of stuff, uh, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.